What is up everybody? My name is Paul and I'm here from Rise Above Fitness here in Shorewood. And I'm here to break one of the most common fitness rumors that I hear all the time. That rumor is that you can both build muscle and lose body fat at the same time. Okay, before I get into this, I just need you to understand that yes, if you're brand new to exercise, you will gain muscle and you will burn body fat. But who cares about short term? We always wanna look long term. I don't care what you do in the first three months, what can you do in your first three years? And the reality is, is that you can't build muscle and lose body fat at the same time. You kind of have to pick and choose. I know everybody wants to gear towards losing body fat because they want to look a certain way, but sometimes gaining muscle might be your better option. I'm gonna go through the important points about gaining muscle and why you might wanna consider doing that instead of losing body fat. The first is you need to be in a caloric surplus. 500 calories at a minimum. The reality is, is that you're not gonna be able to grow muscle if you're not eating more calories than you're outputting. This is going to boost your metabolism long term. So as you continue to gain muscle month after month after month, you will actually increase the amount of calories you burn at rest month after month after month. You will have a better muscle definition at a higher body fat percentage you will see your muscles more defined at 20% body fat than if you were to be a lesser muscle density in size at 15%. Which brings me to my next point, gaining muscle size and density. It's also really important to understand that that rolls back into boosting your metabolism and the only way to boost your metabolism is through building size and density through your muscles. The only downside to building muscle or gaining muscle is you most likely will gain fat in the process. And the reason is, is because it's almost impossible to hit 500 calories every day. So you might have some slip ups and accidentally eat too much beyond that and gain a little bit of fat in the process. But it's okay if you look at it as, okay, this is temporary fat on my body, not something I'm going to keep forever. Now let's talk about burning fat because I'm not saying burning fat is a bad thing, but what I find in this industry is that people focus so much on fat burning that they end up ruining their metabolism and end up yo-yoing. Let me give you an example. If you are eating always at a 500 calorie deficit and you're always burning fat, you will have actually a less calorie burn at rest than if you were to focus on gaining muscle. Now the reason this is is because Fat and muscle both have calories that get burned. So fat burns about 20 calories an hour and muscle burns about 50 calories an hour. Okay, so if you lose about 30 pounds of fat, you're burning less calories. So then you have to become more restrictive with your diet. That actually rolls into my next point, which it means it lowers your metabolism. I hate to break it to you, but when you burn your body fat, your metabolism goes down. It makes your current muscle definition more defined. This is the area that people think is going to, you know, make them successful with their goals. This is the whole reason they want to lose body fat. But remember, if you gain muscle size and density, you will have better muscle definition at a higher body fat percentage. In the process of doing a 500 calorie deficit, you also may lose a little bit of muscle in the process. And the reason being is the same reason you might gain a little bit of fat when you're gaining muscle. You're not gonna be perfect at that 500 calorie deficit every day, so sometimes your body prioritizes burning your muscle instead of your fat. Now remember, the whole point of this is to get you guys to understand that fitness companies will say and do anything to try and get your business. But the reality is, gaining muscle and burning fat long term is almost impossible to do it at the same time.